Enlightenment is like a crystal. And then there's many different facets to the crystal, which are like lenses to enter into it. And you could think of every single form in the universe, every kind of thought, every feeling, every sensation, every uh, story, every concept as one of these potential facets, as well as like each being being one of these potential facets. Um, and this kind of metaphor uh, can sort of be extended into every single area. And that's why it's so good for something like enlightenment, because you are able to penetrate in to the enlightened mind, the unborn mind, the non-arising mind, through any facet of anything, any any form, any any reality. Because the truth that you realize is that all form is empty. And that this like oneness or like this um reality which you're actually in isn't related to form at all. And it has it has no form, but it's not formless. And it's empty, but there's no explicit emptiness. Um there's basically nothing's changed, but there's actually a subtle change where everything is completely different. Um, so yeah, I just thought I'd expose about that a bit. Just so you know, you can contact me on Twitter via DMs anytime, as well as like Instagram and all that stuff. If you want to chat, I don't mind.